And you might Kevin Conroy. Batman. Kevin Conroy, who does, he voices Batman. Yeah. Right, right. But Keanu Reeves is voicing Batman right here. So is that why he's gonna look on his face like, like this about a bitch? Yeah, yeah. Right. Right. Son of a bitch took my gig. Yeah. You're replacing him with a guy who can't act. Yeah. Yeah. Hey everyone, do you enjoy double toasted? Then put it on your body. Check out our tpublic.com merch store where you'll find all these wonderful designs that look great on high quality t-shirts with more designs coming soon. Or check out other high quality items such as mugs, pillows, tote bags, and more. Once again, that is tpublic.com, T-E-E public.com. Or click the link in the description below. So everybody's talking about out there how Robert Pattinson is the the best Batman we have so far. Treat you. For the good! Rilla's like, what? Burgers can run? I, 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 yeah. Burgers can run? Burgers can run! I've seen they that clip of him. I don't know what he yeah. said. <laughs> Burgers can run! And, is, are you doing riddles now? I don't know. Yeah. What the? I, guards? I'm, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> this man's annoying me. <laughs> He's good. He's he's great. You know, he's got the he's got the whole dark thing down whether he's Batman or Bruce Wayne. You know, he's uh, he's scary. So yeah, yeah. You know, I am not going to argue with a lot of people and they say, "Hey, you know what? This is this is probably the best Batman that we have out there." But wait. <laughs> Let's not get ahead of ourselves oh. right now. You know, we got someone else out there talking about, "You know what? Let me throw my cape into the mix." <laughs> and that would be your boy Keanu Reeves. Okay. Keanu Reeves, and people are like, wait a minute, because Keanu Reeves himself, he's like, hold on, wait a minute. Somebody told me that they are making a Batman movie with a dog. And y'all know Keanu Reeves <laughs> is the ultimate dog person out there. John Wick, anybody? Yeah. You know, if you can, if you making a movie with Batman as a dog, you get like let old John Wick come in here and try out for Batman. WB said, "Well, you know what? Can't argue with that. You're hired." <laughs> they brought him in. Nobody else wants. No, to nobody else. <laughs> <laughs> hey, shit, they, they know. I, who's gonna argue with Keanu Reeves, especially when it comes down to a dog? They gave him the job. Was it the right decision? Well, let's go ahead and take a look at this trailer. Cause I know Martin's got this, what the f are you talking about look right now? People, this is DC League of Super Pets. That's what I was gonna ask, that's yeah, what I thought it was. That's yeah. what it is. Yeah. And mm -hmm. this is the, now the trailer's already been out there, but this is the Batman teaser oh, that they okay. put out for this. With highlights. <laughs> how timely. <laughs> how yeah, they knew what they were doing. Yeah. 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 So y'all like, you do another Batman segment? No, they are doing another Batman segment. We're just, are, yeah. yeah, we're just picking up on it. Batman works alone, except for Robin and Alfred, Commissioner Gordon, my IT crew. <clears throat> a lot of people talking about, I can already tell there's a chill in the room. People don't like this shit. <laughs> but I'm, nah, I'm actually, I'm, a, I'm, I'm in the my, minority here. I thought that that was actually kind of fun. Yeah. And I, you know, look, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, listen, I'm a Batman fan and I'm a John Wick fan. So, and I like this because they say, you know, Batman don't kill shit. If John Wick is doing the voice, he'll kill a f anybody <laughs> messing with that dog right there. But I like, I actually like this, man. Uh, I think the thing is, we talk about Keanu's acting sometimes and how, you know, it goes different places and different areas and <laughs> different times. It's a generous know. way of putting it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but I he think. He is press agent. Yeah. I actually think that he's doing pretty well as, uh, as, as, as Batman right here. Do I want to see him be a live action Batman? That's not what I'm saying. But the voice of Batman sounds like some of his most inspired work in a while. Not really great with animals, so I steal myself. My emotions. And plus, it's good to see Batman kind of lighten up a little bit. You know, all it took was a service animal to get him there, which I never seen anything with this. Uh, I've never seen anything with the DC League of Pets. I don't know anything about it. This is my first time. Actually, I look. I know who Crypto the dog is, and yeah, you, some of the other you animals. Know Ace the Bat Hound. He's he's on Batman Beyond. Oh, That's yeah, 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 yeah. I, yeah. yeah, I do. Okay, yeah, I do know this character who's voiced by Kevin Hart. Sure. Yeah, I'm 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 less put off by Keanu Reeves than I am by Kevin Hart. I was like, 
Oh, I got to sit through another Kevin Hart. Well, he's doing and, voices. And the, and the Rock yeah. collaboration. Yeah, Man, but, but you know, the thing is, is that this is not Kevin Hart doing that high-pitched, you know, black comedian voice. You know, he's... Yeah, 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 I was going to say, yeah. I'm sorry. He, he, he had a hard time. He was... He was Tamping yeah. it down and then just, well, I'll just wait teaser. to see the movie to see if it happens. Fair enough. Because, man, y'all hating on this, right? Y'all don't really like this. Well, honestly, the, the first trailer I saw for it, I was kind of excited about yeah. it. But then watching this one, less so. Because I was like, yeah, these jokes they're pulling in here really aren't that funny. And if this is going to be the level of the humor, this is going to be uh, kind of hard to get through. No, I don't know. I'm just saying. I, I, no, no, I let him keep talking. Yeah, hey, <laughs> no, I'm I, you know, <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I'm, I, I seem to be the only one who's like really like happy about this because I'm looking at, it, I'm like, I, and I get it because people will say, Jesus Christ, I mean, I got to sit through another Dwayne Johnson and Kevin <laughs> Hart movie. Well, 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 yeah, I mean, it's like. Okay, the, Dwayne Johnson, you can be in every movie. It doesn't mean you have to be. Uh, and also, you know, it, like I said, there's, there's some serious Batman, oops, Batman burnout on my part. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. And just like, oh man, boy, you, you, DC, they just want to make, like if you go to the comic book store, to the DC section, more than half the books are Batman-related yeah. books. Well, you know, the thing I think that's cool with this is that this is not meant for adults out there. This is meant really for kids. Right. I mean, come on, it's talking dogs and, and yeah. superheroes. So, you know, it might be Batman burnout for adults, but for the kids, it's still something that I think that they would enjoy. I don't, you know, and I'm getting vibes from another thing out there that's that's kind of the same. I like, and also I'm looking forward to seeing with some of the other voices. And I'll get into what I think I can compare this to in a little while. But, I, you know, besides Kevin Hart and and Keanu Reeves, who I really like doing the voice right here, and uh, and of course Dwayne Johnson, you know, I like some of the other voices they've had, they have here. And I'm curious of what some of them are going to do, particularly one. Uh, you have John Krasinski and Kate McKinnon. By the way, I, you know, and I love John Krasinski. I know Kate McKinnon's and everything, and you know, we've seen her and all kind of stuff. It's no surprise here, but you know, John Krasinski. I'm curious to see what he will do. Uh, Diego Luna is doing a voice here. The one I'm curious about, though. Chihuahua. Yeah. <laughs> the one I'm curious about here is uh, Man, Kevin Conroy. That. Kevin Conroy, who does he voices Batman. Yeah. Right. Right. But Keanu Reeves is voicing Batman right here. So is that why he's got to look on his face like, like this about a bitch? Yeah, yeah. Right? This, this son of a bitch took my gig. <laughs> you replace me with a guy who can't act. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder how people gonna respond to this, knowing that Kevin Conroy is in here and who, is, for some people, is the ultimate Batman, mm -hmm. and yet he's not Batman. You know? Joke yeah, I'm sure it'll be some yeah kind of joke in there. I don't know what it is. He'll, watch he'll place. Watch he'll be the Joker. <laughs> yeah, he might. He might. He actually does. I think he's done Superman's voice. One time too, I, I believe. He has I'm no Superman sure. voice. Yeah, so, um, mm -hmm. I don't know. I, that Morgan Freeman joke, I was like, "Come on, man!" And then it's a little too meta for me. And then, um, like I said, I liked the first trailer I saw. Yeah, and I was interesting. Yeah. Oh, I wonder who all the pets are going to be, and I wonder who has their pets in this. And then this one just, I was like, "Come on, man!" And and and, and I hate to say this, but they hire Kevin Hart for a reason, not for him to speak slow and low like that. I mean, like you said, he has a hard time even with the cadence on that. So he's gonna go nuts in a minute. <laughs> yeah. So uh, uh, Krasinski, John Krasinski is gonna be Superman in this. Damn, so they took they took all the Kevin oh, Conroy really? shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and Kevin McKinnon's gonna be yeah. somebody hopping around. Yeah. Kev dog jumping Kevin Conroy is gonna do a cameo like a talking frog or something like yeah, that. Yeah, they just kind of threw him a bone. Yeah. Well, they, oh. 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 They, they may be doing a meta joke. Oh. Come about on, Batman. man. <laughs> yeah. Goddamn, Mr. Freeze over here. I know. Yeah. I don't want to hear it anymore, yeah. Martin. Don't you talk about the humor in this? Yeah. Man, you do that shit over there. <laughs> The humor in this, I don't know, but throw him a bone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know, man. By the way, people, uh, let me stop real quick. You don't have too much to do with this, but let me stop. I got to do my bill paying duties right here, and I got to tell you just real quick, uh, do an ad. And it's, again, it is something that I use, and that is just real quick. Let me tell you about this, and I guarantee that you could probably use this too because nobody likes standing in line at the post office. It's good to see Batman being cool, but he'll go back to a dark place if he has to go stand in the post office. That'll take anybody to a real messed up dark place. <laughs> How many of y'all, let me ask you something. How many of y'all during the holidays went out to try to mail packages and the line was out the door? How many of y'all have businesses, you know, that you gotta do fulfillment where you have to like mail off packages to people, numerous packages, 
and it's a hassle to drive over there to the, to, to the post office while the line is out the door because ever since the pandemic, a damn thing ain't changed with it. Well, now you don't have to do that. And I actually have, I've had this, uh, this service for a long time. I forgot I actually had it. Now I have it again. I'm going to start using it. But I'm talking about if you hate the post office like anybody else. Shit, postmen hate the post office. They hate their jobs. <laughs> and if that is you, go to stamps.com. What this is, is that this allows you to do a lot of the services that you get at the post office that you do at UPS. Now you can do that through your computer right there. All that official postage that you need to get done, all those labels you need to actually print out and make, you don't have to go to the post office anymore. Do that at home, the convenience of your own home, and just drop them off and be on about your way and about your day. Time is money. If you have a business, you're mailing the stuff off, you know that's important. So stop standing in line when you don't have to. Stop spending more money when you don't have to. Uh, the other thing with this is that trustworthy company, been around for 20 years, stamps.com. Uh, and as I said, it gives you all the access that you would get at a regular post office, but you can do it all yourself at home now. Uh, as I said, packages, invoices, are you just printing out stamps? Hey, don't, please don't go to the post office to go pick up no stamps no more. <laughs> this makes it worth it alone for that. But if you happen to do any of those things, please try the service out. I remember using this a long time ago when we were starting out Double Toast and I had so many packages to mail out to people. I had so much stuff to do and we used this and it saved, saved our lives. Saved us a lot of time and money, man. Go on over to stamps.com and use the code TOASTED right there. And you can use that for a special offer that includes a four-week trial, free postage, and they'll give you a digital scale, even making it more of a reason why you don't have to go to the post office. And there are no commitments and no contracts involved, so you got nothing to lose except money and time. I want to thank stamps.com for sponsoring and supporting this part of the show. And I want to thank all of you, as usual, for your support. Um, you know, with this, I was saying it reminded me of something else. Because uh, I can see if people are burned out. Because I do wonder how this is going to do against... Because there's been a lot of... You know, listen, you're right. There's a lot of Batman out there. Mm -hmm. I mean, shit, there's a lot of Batman in one week that we just had. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And I get it, people are tired of it. But, you know, those things that... Those Batman things we're talking about, we're talking about straight Batman movies, funny Batman movies. We're talking about spoofs that we've already had for kids out there. It must be great to be Batman. Batman, we love you! I'm home. I'm home. I'm home. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and that was a very funny movie. Yeah, very funny. I mean, and I have to great. say that there were some people, the thing is, and I'm not talking about anybody in this room at all, but I do know that there were some people who looked at this and like, oh, really? Legos and Batman? And even then, people are saying, damn, don't we have enough Batman? And the movie ended up being critically well-received and ended up being a big hit. Yeah. yeah. And so, yeah, that's why I'm keeping my mind open with this. You know, I'm, I'm, I don't mean not knowing too much about Batman. With, I mean, I'm sorry, the League of Super Pets, I barely know them. I haven't read any comics or anything. I haven't watched any cartoons. I know some of the animals like Crypto and Batman's dog. But I'm looking forward to this. And there's some jokes that did make me laugh. I know you didn't like that joke, but that joke with Morgan Freeman had me laughing pretty hard. Batman works alone, except for Robin and Alfred, whoever Morgan Freeman played. You know, and it's true because Batman always talking about how he's, he works better by himself and he got all these mother... You know, he's got a team of people. That's the only way you could be Batman. That, that yeah. is. But he always wants to pull this, huh? I'm a loner, I'm a rebel. You know? No, man, you got an IT team, as you said. You got a whole marketing team behind you. He's got to have a team that goes around and picks up all the batarangs that get thrown. Yeah. Or, yeah. or, or, or the leftovers yeah. from the from the grappling hooks that are just right. dangling. Or spackles all the holes that he's left yeah. with his grappling hook. All the trailer crippled people that he used to left behind. <laughs> you know, I... I uh, Again, I can see, I, I totally understand. I totally, I haven't, and I'm not even, it's not me debating or arguing with anybody. I totally get why people would be like, look, man, I got bat fatigue right now. I just don't need no more Batman. And if this was another, like, Batman TV show for adults, this was, and you're going to get more on HBO oh, Max, so course, it's like, hey, course, you know, so it, wasn't, it ain't done yet. I get it. Batman's not the focus of this whole movie. No. I, or I, I, I only say that about this particular clip. Like yeah, I said, yeah, the, the, the first trailer I saw, I was like, oh, this looks like fun. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Yeah. 
Same here. Well, I just think Keanu Reeves actually makes a good Batman too. But maybe I'm just like everybody else. You just love Keanu Reeves. I'm like everybody else who's like, you know what? Keanu Reeves, and he's a good guy. Mm -hmm. What about his actor? What about it, man? Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what, what, what about his actor? I said he's a good guy. Yeah. <laughs> so it was nice. No, you know, he, he, like you know, he he he's been doing some good voiceover work. I mean, like he killed it in Toy Story Four. True. And um, I think he did something else after that. I can't remember. That's true. He did, did a. Well, voice. He, he wasn't really doing a. He wasn't really a voice, but he was in SpongeBob as a talking head. Oh. Ke Keanu Reeves talking head. So. You know, well, he, he killed in Toy Story 4. No, he did. That uh, was the Canadian... Uh, yeah, the Canadian, Duke Kaboom. Duke yeah. Kaboom, yeah. Like, like the evil Knievel toy. Man, yeah. you were right about that. I yeah. forgot. That's a great reference. Yeah, right he was really good. No, he was good at that. He, man, this, that's a How thing is he in Cyberpunk? He's Keanu Reeves, so he's not... Man, you know, he's just... I, look, he's Keanu Reeves. If you love Keanu Reeves, then yes, that's cool. If you don't like Keanu Reeves, then he's being Keanu Reeves. What you do? Okay. Yeah, I mean, I think when... Keanu, Keanu Reeves is really good, I think, when he is... Behind a mic, not having to be in front of a camera, and just being let loose to go. And I know it sounds like I'm calling bad actor, but, I know, but it does. Like, but I think that he's able to like because when he's doing voice work, yes. because today a lot of people hire Keanu Reeves. You know, it's just like a lot of actors now they're hiring Keanu Reeves. Uh, but when he's doing voice work, he gets to be other characters. Mm, yeah. You know, there's a if you see him in a movie like when he takes a great departure from being Keanu Reeves. He's actually really good. I always talk about that movie, The Gift, where he played like a racist Southern guy. Sure, yeah. And he was not the same person you ever saw. That's and he true. was brilliant in that, Those man. Those are few and far between. Yeah, but <laughs> that's because been... people hire him to be Count o Reeves, or Bill, or Ted, or whatever. Well, then, they, 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 they let him do whatever he want for a while. I mean, he just didn't really deliver. I mean, you know, because sometimes it's fucking insane. Sorry. Oh. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. It's still knock knock. <laughs> and in knock knock, he was still Keanu Reeves. He was just Keanu Reeves that just let two crazy chicks into his house. And even then, I tell you what, it, the the best parts is when he let go. Okay. That was free pizza. You know, I was like, okay. That's it. That's what we're looking for right there. Yeah. You know, let loose, man. That was terrible. <laughs> oh, I, I actually. You, you, I, I mean, it's fun to watch. Don't get me wrong. But I was like, it was like they had like, no, man, really, get get it, sell it. And every time I watch that scene, I laugh mostly because it's like, wow, he's it, it, there's not a real conviction in oh, his voice. He's no, just it's, loud. It's a no. It's because we already said it's a bad movie. Yeah, yeah. But I. <laughs> I liked it though. I'm not gonna lie, I enjoy it's, watching it's entertaining, that. But I, it's entertaining. Yeah. Not good. Work. Yeah, man. <laughs> I actually. No, it's. <laughs> yeah, that was that. No. What happened, bro? <laughs> he's like, yeah, you say all the shit you want to. Yeah. But let me, Martin is just like, you know what? I'm tired. I don't like this shit. So get the fuck out of here. No, Martin no, is just cutting no, me down no, no matter no, what. He's no, just got no, like, no, hey no, man, no. let's get the. No, no, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> really look, look, not. I can't let this go on like this anymore. Look, man, it was terrible. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, obviously, anything I say, Mark's gonna be like, "Yeah, it's shitty, man." Yeah. So it's just no, like, I'm yeah, not. so I'm not, man. you know you, what? You can, you can enjoy. You can enjoy what you enjoy. Yeah, as long as I don't, you know, tell you about it. <laughs> Because Mark would be like, yeah, it's, yeah, it's shitty. All of a sudden, you became Patrick Gerber. I was about to say, <laughs> it sounds like you became, like, you just saw the Batman or something. <laughs> you you, you did the same exact thing I did. Yeah. You know, he's talking to Curtis. <laughs> oh, no. We're the same, Martin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like the Riddler talking to Batman. Yeah, yeah and you're like, like no, we're, we're not. Oh, fuck. Maybe he's right. We're Damn the it. same. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling you, man. You're not so different, you and me. Yeah. I guess I'm in a room where everybody just said, this shit. I'm the only one that likes it. I obviously, know, I, I, I say this shit. <laughs> I'm not even saying. I said I like the first trailer. Yeah. I never saw a first trailer, so maybe that's what it is with with me here. But got me looking forward to it. So, yeah. You and, know, and it, it, it could easily. Well, it won't be another Lego Batman, but you no. know, there's, there's there's nothing to say this won't yeah, be a movie. Yeah. Or, yeah. right. right, who knows, man? I, you know, like I said, I'm going in. It's coming out in May. gives us gives us enough space between sure. the last Batman movie that came out, and uh, and then that one right there. So you know, if anybody's got Batman out from this, first of all, this is the adults Batman. Now they're putting out something for kids, and I think that this is going to be a cute thing for kids right here. But we'll see. I and, mean, and, and, look, and, it could be terrible. And it won't know? be the Batman show. It it's could all be about awesome. the pets. It could yeah. be awesome. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, May twentieth is when this comes out. Until then. Everybody saying Corey. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
no, no, I'm kidding. I'm, no, I, I'm, I, do, I know I'm joking. I'm I do joking. love that animated movies bring that out in both of you, whether it's this or cars. Well, or, again, <laughs> again, again, it's you in the background because when the one because when Martin ever becomes negative like you, you're like, ah, yes, well, yeah, the evil, let it go, because yes, <laughs> embrace the darkness, <laughs> the dark side, yeah, the yeah. dark, yeah. embrace yeah. the dark side, join me, <laughs> and I was like, and we will rule the galaxy. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> and, we're, and we'll be critical of things people like. <laughs> no! Hey everyone, support our Patreon, which helps us to continue bringing you our live streams, videos, and podcasts while bringing you new content such as exclusive live streams and animated shorts. 